And once again, Columbia over to Savage, Columbia over to Savage. What we're seeing here on radar is a little bit of a notching feature, a little bit of a notching feature back here just north of Columbia. And once again, our friends here do not want to hear about this because last Thursday, of course, we had a brief spin up tornado in some of these same neighborhoods working down across portions of Howard County. So tornado warning is going to go until 345 until 345. If you're in the neighborhood of Savage back up towards Columbia, moving along portions of 27 right now, as well as 29 and 32 back up towards the West Friendship and Eldersburg area, seeing a lot of lightning here, a lot of lightning. If we can go back over to the velocity mode, the velocity mode, we'll see what's going on. And you can see right here, Right here, just west of the sea in Columbia, heading out towards Clarksville. Also have a little bit of a damage report out towards Damascus. And these are basically showing gusty winds and the possibility of some rotation where we're getting a little bit of that brighter shade of pink back up a little there just south of West Friendship there. We're getting that shading of green, but in particularly north of Clarksville right now, north of Clarksville is where I am concerned where we're seeing these heavier shades of white as well as pink, these brighter shades, and this produced a little bit of wind damage back towards Damascus, just south of Mount Airy, along 27, but just east of the 32 placard there, just south of Pine Orchard, east of Columbia, and north of Clarksville. Tornado warning until 345. That's where we're picking up on the rotation there, just basically north and east of Waterloo, north and east of Waterloo, north of Simpsonville. Right now, if you're in Glen Elge, Clarksville, Columbia, back over to Simpsonville, I want you to take your tornado precautions as necessary. All of the walls around you, something to cover your head, innermost closet or room, the basement or the bathroom. Tornado warning once again goes until 345. Some of the cities here, as Marcus is pulling them up for me, in Simpsonville at 334. Oakland Mills at 336 and Pfeiffer's Corner at 341 p.m. Clarksville right now you're starting to see some of that wind moving on through that brighter little couplet there just north of town. If we can zoom in a little bit tighter, maybe we can get a street level view here of what's going on. Very, very bright shading of white showing up here. Uh, right here it looks like traffic circle, traffic circle uh, road right now just east of 32, east of 32. It uh, doesn't seem, seem like we have any towns here, but this is just north, uh, just south, actually, south of west of Pine Orchard, southwest of Pine Orchard, and now starting to come into the west side, the west side of Columbia. So nice little tight couplet here, nice tight little couplet, and you can see how it just cycled out just like that. So a broader view shows the wind, the wind still in place here and also getting a little bit of rotation just north of Pine Orchard, just north of Pine Orchard where we're getting the greens meeting up with the reds where we're getting the greens just east of West Friendship right now. Even in these areas where you're outside of the polygon, we want you to take your tornado precautions as necessary. Once again, tornado warning until 345 p.m. If you're north of Clarksville right now, seeing some of those issues, I'm going to check back in with meteorologist Marcus Walter to see what he is seeing there on the radar here at the moment. But once again, that brighter shading of pink that we're seeing west of Columbia right now, west of Columbia, that's our circulation point with the tornado warning that will go until 345 p.m. Marcus? Yes, and as we put a track on this to give you an idea of which way this storm is headed, we'll put a couple of more cities up there. Columbia, you potentially will be in line to feel the impacts of this sail, of this strong thunderstorm that has a, a tornado warning on it. Uh, so this is something you really do need to keep in mind. You've been through this already within the last week, so you know that you need to get to your safety places. You need to get away from windows. Also, Pine Orchard, you need to do the same thing because this has not been confirmed yet, but again, we have seen signs of rotation with this particular uh, thunderstorm that has that tornado warning on it. Now I'll put the radar back on just so you can see how much rain is falling with this storm system as well. And we'll put it, actually I'll put it into the now mode. So you see right here where West Friendship is, where we have some of that activity is covered in rain. So we have a lot of rain, we have a lot of lightning. So we have an intense thunderstorm rolling through. And as 